Hey, what's up everybody? It's Mike here. And in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to record in separate audio tracks, AKA multi-track recording in OBS studio. First, we're going to go to the settings. Then we're going to go to the output tab. Under the streaming tab, we want to make sure we always have the first audio track selected here. Under the recording tab, if you look down under the recording settings section, you'll see there's audio tracks listed. You're going to have up to six. OBS will allow you to record and split up to six separate audio tracks. For me, because I'm only focusing on my desktop audio and microphone, I'm actually going to leave three selected. The first track is going to be for our streams mix. The second track is going to be for our desktop or mic. And the same thing with the third is going to be set for our desktop or mic, uh, whatever we decide to do. So go ahead and hit OK. Next, we're going to focus on the audio mixer in OBS. Down at the bottom of the audio mixer, you're going to see these three dots. Let's left click that and select our advanced audio properties. And here we're going to get a horizontal layout of the properties of each audio source that's going to be listed in OBS. Over here on the right, you'll see what I mentioned previously, all six tracks that OBS allows you to split and record separately. You'll see that all these are checked by default. For the sake of this guide, I'm going to go ahead and unselect all of these so we can go through each track separately. So if you remember in the settings under our output tab, under the streaming tab here, we left the audio track selected as audio track one. That is what this first track represents. So anything that you want to go out to your live stream, your desktop audio, your microphone, if you have Spotify, Discord, anything that's piped into OBS that you want to be sent out to your live stream, you're gonna to wanna to select track one. If you are recording this locally, all of that audio would all be mixed into one track under track one. But if you wanted to record each individual audio source separately, that's where the rest of these tracks come in. So if we wanted to record our desktop audio separately, we're just going to go ahead and select track two. So now we'll get a separate audio file for just the desktop audio. And the same thing applies for the microphone. We're going to select the third track here. Now we're going to get a separate audio track for just the microphone. So that way, when the recording is dropped into whatever your video editing software of choice is, uh, you're going to have a track that's going to have all the audio mixed into one. Then you're going to have a separate track just for the desktop audio and another track just for the microphone. And the same rules apply. If you had Discord, you could assign that to like track four. If you had Spotify, you could assign that to track five uh, and so on and so forth. And if you have more audio sources than just the desktop audio and microphone under the output tab, under the recording tab, uh, don't forget to go ahead and select the additional channels that you would also like to add to the recording and then click apply. And with that, now you know how to do multi-track recording within OBS. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, go ahead and like and subscribe. And I will see you guys on the next one. Happy streaming.